guys hope all is well today is 30th may 2024 going to a customer i'm taking i took a couple days off for a little vacation thursday friday saturday sunday well i don't work those days but and monday so three days for vacation a couple days out of my three weeks but anyway um i'm going to the town called new fairfield and i'm gonna see i have a customer who has a pool heat pump issue so let's see what it is Enjoy this weather if it's good where you are. Hello, how are you? What was your first name again? I'm sorry. Elka. Elka. I'm Paul. How are you? Is Paul here too or no? No. So, you, could you show me to the heat pump? What? When did it, you notice it at the beginning of the year? Okay. It's just the, um, it, that, that it's a little cooler today, but once we, if I do get it running, I probably won't get an exact heat load because it's 60 degrees out, but we, if I, you said the compressor's not running or is that what John was saying? Okay. You hear maybe the contact or click, or let's see. Okay. Beautiful. The disconnect, and you have it pulled, right? You have it off? This is off. Okay, you want to turn it on for me, if you don't mind? Um, now, the fan, I notice, like, usually it kicks on like this right away. Yeah. So it has Starting. some hesitation sometimes. Okay. Um, so I usually have, like, a little stick, stick. or something that I help a little bit. I think we'll be able. I'm, I'm not even gonna get that far until I just want to see what it does, and then I'm gonna have to turn. I'm gonna turn it off. Okay. And but, then I usually, so it says it's on 30 something like that. Okay. It takes a few. Yeah. No. No problem. Yeah. Because once you put um, once you reset the voltage, you'll it'll take a, it's on delay. So yeah. um, don't even do that because I'm gonna I'm just gonna turn it off if I see that it doesn't start. I just want to listen to the actual. Yeah, your fan side. I know, I know it's locked up. So hold on. No, that's no, okay. I'm gonna open it. Um, I can hear it. Oh, it I hear it. You're getting you said it's tripping? The filter is on. Yeah, you said it's tripping? No, it doesn't trip, right? You're just turning it off. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. I said I thought you said it tripped at one time, like or another. I, it's off. I'm gonna open it up and just look Do you at want it. A, like a something? I have one. I, a pad? No, I haven't. Sure? I'm a mess. I. You want a cup of coffee? No, thank you. I'm sorry. How long you live here? I live in Denver. Only. Where did you guys come from? Nice. <laughs> yeah, I work um, all northern, southern Westchester, in, into the Bronx. Yep. And then up to South Barry. No, no, no! Don't worry about it. It has a plastic bottom. So let's see what it does. Let me um just. Yeah, I will. I'll tell you. So this is a 55 again, and then this is the 10. So let's test them, okay? And then this is your contactor, which pulls in to send the voltage to both of these. We're gonna take this meter. And we're gonna check. So this fan here is locked up because we can tell. And we spin it like this, and we're getting 9.25 on our 10 microfarad uh, capacitor. And we'll just test it here with our meter. So we set it to microfarads. And this one's 55. So the microfarads on the 55, I'm getting 0.4. However, on my fan, I'm getting 9.25, which tells me the fan motor itself is bad. And this capacitor is bad, not not the fan. So here we're gonna 9.25. So what we'll do is we'll put in a dual because there's two. Why why ch charge for both, right? Put in a dual, and we're gonna have to replace that fan motor. But I think I'm gonna free it up for you at least for to show you that it's operational. But with with the compressor, um, you know, free it up for today, and then we'll order it overnight for you. I can pick it up at Danbury, really. So you have a 50 slash 10. This is an AMRAD made in the United States of America. That's why we use these 
So I, as I was walking up, guys, I said 50. It's a 55. I forgot. So you have your four, you have 25, your 45 to make a 55. All right, guys. So what we did here is we, we know the fan's going to be bad, but what I'm going to do is grease it up to get them going, or at least to test it. Um, we have our fan common at our 10, and then we have our 55 common and 55 zip tied everything up i'm going to just close this and then we are going to pull this fan grease it and then get it to at least free up spinning we're gonna, we already freed this up and it's going to be a temporary fix because we're going to have to replace it and the supply house didn't have it for today so we're going to come back tomorrow however elk is going to take some pv blaster and spray right there on the shaft yep and then also inside just spray it don't say it. what is this yeah, that's good say it don't spray it. you're perfect yeah. you're perfect that's good Okay, so now, so as you saw, guys, before, we were locked up. So now what I'm going to do is take my two fingers here, and you can see how easy that spins. But again, we all know it'll lock up once it heats up, but at least we'll get them going for today. And it is starting to get warm out, so let's uh, just get the uh, heat pump going because who knows if people want to swim or they don't. But it will take hours because it, there's not enough heat outside to... The ambient. What is the temperature today? 60? There's really not enough the way these work, but it is spinning. So let's let's throw this back in and start All right, it. So here's the pool. We're going to start the heat. We're going to start up the heat pump right now, guys. Let's see. And then we uh, have that fan motor on order from SIDS. So let's see. Right now we have regular water temperature. We're dropping 66. Okay, now we're gonna come into the actual jet. And now check the temperature there. Go back to the meter, 69. See that? And now we're gonna pull it away. Over here, 66. See, you're only gonna get about three degrees difference, differential. So then we're going to go back in. And then the temperature goes up. And we're going to come back out. And temperature should go down. There you go. So now we know we're heating. And again, we're not on a, um, we're not on a crazy uh, warm day. But this will be heating a lot more because it'll have more heat to distribute. So we put it on 90. This thing's running, guys. We're going to, we have Sid Harvey getting us a fin for 8 a.m. tomorrow and we'll be back to replace it but it's running well you saw the temperature yeah. difference thank you for watching please like and subscribe i'll be back there tomorrow morning i probably should have just waited for this video to end when i changed that fan motor but that lady was awesome like mad cool queens new york even though I was in New Fairfield, she's lived up here, I think she said eight years, 10 years. But point is, I just like real people. She's real, her husband's real, I spoke to him over the phone, mad cool, in the trades. Thank you for watching, please like and subscribe. Have a great day, take care.